Peace. Um, this is about Tupac Shakur's prison ID card breaks world record after being sold at auction. And as you can see here, it's Tupac Shakur himself singing I don't know where at the time before his passing, allegedly. A prison ID card once owned by late rapper Tupac Shakur has sold at an auction for $30,000. Yeah, so his ID card was sold at an auction for $30,000. So they made a pretty good chunk of change of it. The sale set a world record for the most expensive piece of Tupac memorabilia ever sold at public auction. So yeah, that was the... It was a world record right there for that one, for his ID to be sold at an auction. It comes exactly one month after what would have been the rapper's 48th birthday. Yes, yeah, so it, it would have came one month after, and um, Tupac Shakur would have been 48 this year. Of course, he's a year behind me, so... Heritage Auctions opened bidding on the badge issued February 28th, 1995 by the State of New York Department of Correctional Services at $2,000. So, that, so that's where the bid started at, at $2,000 at the time in 1995. And then, of course, it sold for $30,000. So $2,000 is also a good chunk of change too but um the bidding on the badge issued february 28th 1995 at the time was um by the state of new york department of correctional services more than 10,200 visitors viewed the card before 30 bids were cast for the rare piece of memorabilia so yeah so there was 10,000 visitors, they were viewing the card of what um, it looked like because, you know, and before the 30 bids were starting to come in and everything. Some say Tupac and his music are just as relevant today as they were more than 20 years ago, said Gary Shrum, director of music more memorabilia at heritage auctions so, yeah, so they um saying that tupac's music is more are just as relevant today so yeah of course his music is relevant today because you know more than 20 years than they were more than 20 years ago but i guess they saying that his music his music wasn't that good during that time but it was Fans haven't forgotten his impact on hip-hop. They will go to any lengths to own a piece of Shakur's life and times. Yeah, of course, they're going to do everything they can to get a piece of Tupac Shakur of his life and times after he was having an impact on hip-hop. The ID card had been held privately since the day Shakur gave it to the seller. So that's how long it's been for this ID card to be held. And it was, and it took all this time now for it to be sold at $30,000. Earlier this month, the breakup letter that Madonna received from her ex-boyfriend Shakur while he was in prison, went up for auction. So, yeah, so the letter that um, Tupac wrote to Madonna, that went up for auction as well. So, I didn't have no idea that Madonna and Tupac Shakur were dating at the time, but now when I see ex boyfriend, uh, I was like, what? The note was included as part of a collection of intimate personal items put up for auction by the pop icon's former friend Darlene Lutz. Other items include cassettes and a hairbrush with strands of Madonna's hair. Oh boy. So they put a little bit of piece of Madonna's hair up for auction as well, but there's cassettes, 
um, and whatever else is going up for adoption, auction, I mean, and of course the letter is, of course, um, I don't know how much that the letter is going to go for, the cassettes and a hairbrush, I'm not sure how long they're going to go for, but of course, you know, Madonna's strands, hair, strands of Madonna's hair is in the brush, but who knows how long, or who knows how much that's going to go up for, because these auctions are not cheap. Nope, they're not. They're pretty much, exp wherever bid they start at, that's where they start it. Then it goes up after that. Leave your comments below. I am out.